What's up guys? It's nice. Spring is here, so we're gonna see if we can pop in here and pick up a push mower. So stay tuned. So I found a ego mower here. Sometimes you can find these good deals on Lowe's. Down here for 150, well 749, no battery. Um yeah, it's a good deal. And they have the other one. Now 200 was 849. So both self better. And see which one we're gonna go with here. So I'm gonna think about it and we'll see here shortly. So I decided to go with the Ego self propel touch drive, 8.3 pounds of torque with the select cut. We got the two blade system up to 75 minutes of run time. So we're gonna get this to the house. We're gonna unbox it and we're gonna show you what it can do. Make sure you subscribe, like, or follow whatever platform this video is on and check it out. It's gonna be really cool. All right, guys, got this box here on the table. Um, like I said, we picked up at Lowe's. There's no battery. It's an open box. So, the first thing I'm gonna pull out here is a rapid charger. This one's a little bit different than the other charger. This one's gonna charge the battery a little bit faster. I think these chargers retail for about, um, I wanna say 150, 150 bucks, something like that. Now the good feature about this mower is it has 8.3 pounds of torque. It's a dual select cut, so it has dual blade at the bottom. So it gets a, a double cut on the grass blades. I have a side discharge, just like the other Ego mowers. Clips on the side, we'll get there in a second. That would have been a battery pack. <laughs> All right, comes with the bagger. Well, okay, instructions. Like I said, never read those. I don't know, maybe not. So we'll put that bag together here shortly. I'll show you guys how to do that for you guys opening a box not knowing how to put the bagger together. Oh yeah. A little heavy. <laughs> Woo, it's a little heavy. <laughs> Box right away. There it is, all folded up. That's another good feature about this mower. You can fold it up. So uh, yeah, let's walk through some of the features of this mower. All right, so when you're getting ready to take out this mower and mow the lawn first thing you want to do is push this lever it allows it to go up oh look at that <laughs> and then to extend the handles here you pull these clips out here and that goes fully out until you see the arrows on the inside so now you got to make sure that these are fully extended out so that you engage the blades and the self-propelled mechanism. Now your battery pack is going to go in here. You lift up and then place the battery in there. Now the other thing is what I really like about the Ego mowers um, is there's a lever that allows all four wheels to make the deck go up and down. So you don't have to adjust every single wheel like the old school gas push mowers, self-propelled mowers where you have to adjust every single wheel. With this one, you just push it down, I mean pull it out, and pull. And that'll give you your, your height adjustment on there. So if you're doing real tall grass, go all the way to seven. Maintain between two and three. If you want to scalp, go to one. Um, I'm sure you could probably cut some lawns on the one setting. But yeah, uh, what else? So this is the the discharge you can mulch with this mower or you can discharge you're gonna lift up the back of the mower here and there's a groove in the back that it slides into and you pop it into place and it just shoots the grass out the side out of the back so um, let's dig into getting this bagger put together so everything can't be super easy you got to figure something out so Put the bagger on, it comes like this. Gotta slide the bag inside the pole. Slide it inside. Go under this 
loop bar right here and then you're gonna clip it on all right take the other ones there on the side and clip those on as well all right so to get the rest of it on clip this on the next line onto the bar so your bag should be on like that go to the other side Clip up at the top. You're gonna stick your finger under the plastic part so you can pull it on. Bag is ready, it should look like this, all ready to go. Handle right here to help you assist to dump the clippings when you clip. Okay. That was simple enough for you guys. There you go. Just gotta pull it all around like that. Bag's ready to go. Now, I want to get off the subject for just a second with with the mower here but I, as I was noticing as I looked over at this charger this charger has a feature that every other charger don't have you can actually download an app and connect your charger directly to your phone to know what your percentage is when your battery's charging that's a pretty cool feature so if you're like you know just taking a break and your battery's charging and your phone sees a notification oh your battery's charged i know it sounds lazy but it's just another feature that ego has provided for the charger so just wanted to show you that as well it's pretty cool so this mower is supposed to come with a 10 amp battery and like i said i think this was a display so they were selling it for cheap <laughs> um anyways so this mower comes with actually another set of blades i didn't know it come with another set of blades i was getting ready to show you how to put on the blades on the mower here but apparently it's already got mulching blades on there so that's how the the blades are set up under the deck and this particular model um yeah it's pretty cool because you got double cut action and i've seen a lot of videos where they talk highly of this mower but we're about to try it out here shortly now let's go over some <laughs> other things i've missed there's so much on this mower i just i feel like i can't get it all in one session talking about it but um anyway this is gonna be your speed control right here for your um how do you call it uh, self-propelled this is where you're going to turn it on this is your led light for the front so if you're mowing at night or mowing early in the morning some people do i know i do so that's a good really good feature and i know these lights are probably a little bit brighter than the other ego mower that i tried before and um so yeah let's get a battery i have a seven and a half amp battery i think i have one already charged and we're going to test out the different options uh, first i'm going to do the the side shoot show you how that one will shoot out the grass and then we're going to do the mulching option and then of course bagging because i like bagging my grass i like for it to look good so keep watching so we got a seven and a half amp battery here 7.5 amps we're fully charged now i'm just gonna say i'm just gonna do a video on how the mower runs not so much on run time i can do another video on that later on but this is just for showing the performance of the mower all right so what you're gonna do is slide that door open i like that find some buzz light your action going on there <laughs> anyway you'll slide the battery in as you can see that there's a little gap here because this mower is designed for a 10 amp battery i mean this battery is 7.5 amp and a 10 amp is just gonna be a little bit bigger so um let's give it a shot so I like this luscious green grass in the front <laughs> rye grass is about to um die off soon because the spring is here so just waiting a little bit longer for the dye and the um centipede to come in but uh yeah let's do it all right we got it set on to forward. 
forward I want to explain something so when you squeeze down on the trigger that's your self propelled taking off see that and then you can adjust the speed you can go low right here if you want to go low less off if you want to go a little bit slow speed it'll take you slow speed when you get ready to turn on the mower it just says hold down this bar right here and then push the button to engage the blade oh. see the blades engaged now Let's look at a difference here. These first two paths are mulched. It leaves a clean cut. You know, it, it looks like it was bagged. Now you go to the second, the next two rows, and you see these clumps of grass right here. Okay, now you gotta remember this grass, um, a little tall. So if you're doing maintenance, you're not gonna see these clumps of grass like this. This grass is probably about six inches tall or whatever okay now the last two paths here are bagged you can see there wasn't a trace left of grass here i mean you can get down on your knees and try to find blades of grass but i don't see any so there's your differences There's a lot of poo in this yard. <laughs> Hey guys, I gotta say, overall, this mower is a beast for a battery mower. I mean, with the double blades, I can't imagine what it's gonna do in fall time and get rid of mulch leaves, but we're just getting into summer here in March. So, um, yeah, let me show you the battery as well. I know I said I was gonna do a different video on that, but I decided to go ahead and do the whole yard. Um, on this battery pack, I got one bar left. So remember, you gotta think about the conditions you're mowing in. I mean, I didn't use the self-propelled the whole time, and then when I did use it, I used it on full throttle. I did back it down a little bit on some. The grass is a little bit higher. It's about 75-ish degrees today. I can't remember the exact temperature. If I know it's in the 70s, let me check, and I'll see what the temperature is here. Um, we're at 72 degrees today. So, um, yeah, you got to think about all the conditions. Now, this mower, or any mower with battery, any tools with battery, is going to run better in colder conditions. So, keep that in mind. But, um, if I didn't use the self-propelled function, you probably could do about maybe two yards with this 7.5 amp battery. But two quarter acre yards. I know the ratings say 75 minutes. I don't go on minutes. I go on how much land, how much grass, how much turf can I mow without the battery going dead. So um, I really am excited about this mower and see what it's gonna do this season. Um, the self-propelled is a good function, but the mower, keep in mind, is pretty light. I would say the self-propelled would be good just to get up hills 
if you're tired and you just need an extra bump, that's what that self propel would be good for. Unless you just don't feel like pushing the mower and you just want to tug along with one hand. That's fine too. But um, I'd highly recommend to someone if you're willing to spend $850 with a 10 amp battery, you can find them on Marketplace. Um, but I recommend buying it new. This is technically a new mower. It just uh, didn't have a battery with it. I think it was a demo. So anyways, if you have anything you want to add, make sure you add in the comment section below. Make sure you subscribe, like, subscribe, like, or follow whatever platform this video is on. Thanks for watching so much. See you in the next one. Take care and God bless.